Pagbabalik tayo sa Kababayan Today. Ako po si G. Tanji. We are in Los Angeles. And now it's time for the Real Estate Buzz with Mia McLeod. This Real Estate Buzz segment is brought to you by McLeod & Associates, a full-service real estate and mortgage firm. It's not about the number of homes we sell. It's about the difference we make in people's lives. Magandang hapon, Mia. Thank you so much for being here once again on Kababayan today. Thanks. Magandang hapon, too, to all of our viewers. Maraming salamat po for your support. All right. And uh, pag-usapan natin ngayong araw na ito, five common questions that buyers have. Yes. Uh, and I'm very interested because balang araw bibili rin ako ng bahay. <laughs> okay. Can't so wait. I know. <laughs> Can people buy a home and sell the one that they're currently in? Does it work that way? How, how does that work out? You absolutely can. People think they have to sell their current home and then buy separately. You can do it simultaneously. And there's three different ways I'd like to touch on it really quickly here. One, you can close on your current home. You may have to either rent or stay in a hotel for a week or two until your other one closes or one of our clients Airbnb did it. Um, you could do it that way. Or two, you can actually negotiate and rent back from the new owner once it closes until your other property closes. And third, you can do what we call a contingency sale, which says, you know, buyer, we are gonna sell contingent upon us closing on our other property. So there's three ways that so you can- So lots of options for the buyer. Yes, and your realtor can tell you the pros and cons of each one. Okay, right? wonderful. Now, yes. ilang mga bahay ang kailangan makita bago Offer. Oh my gosh, there is no rule for this. People think they need to see 20 houses before they make an offer. You know, right now with online, everyone can see that property online. There's virtual tours, there's property tours. So my recommendation is when you see that property physically and you know you like it, make an offer that day, especially in a hot market like today where there's multiple offers on the table. You don't want to miss out on that opportunity. So some of our buyers, on their first tour within hours, they make an offer and some they do take weeks okay. but what you don't want to do is have any regrets because you feel like oh I need to see 20 properties before I can make one because you know when you go into a house this is it right yes, like there's you know. that feeling yes it's like again your first date right you don't know you don't need to date 20 people before you know oh he's the one or right. she's the one right so you know yes and it'll feel it'll, it'll feel, feel like it yeah right? you don't want to miss out on the opportunity Okay, and right. then how do people know if a property is a good deal or not? Okay, and because everyone wants a good deal. Absolutely, and you don't want to pay a penny more than what it's worth, mm -hmm. right? And us as your real estate professionals, we definitely want to get you a fantastic deal. So that's where we step in and we provide you with the comps. What's going on again in the last 12 months? What has been going on in the neighborhood? What's the turnover like? What are the properties in that neighborhood closing per square foot to help you come up with the proper price to make an offer on so okay. get with your realtor on that okay yeah. and then how quickly are you able to close, close. Um, um, a, on, property. On a property 30 to 45 days is standard so 30 to 45 days okay yes very short time yes what about the home inspection Mahal yes. Bayon? it's about you know 295 to 395 on average and a lot of buyers think they don't need to get a home inspection it's not mandatory but I highly recommend it because you want to lift that burden of thinking about plumbing roofing AC heater and all of that you don't want to worry about the condition of that after it's closed and you're already the homeowner mm -hmm. if you do a home inspection during the process and there are things that maybe don't sit well with you you can request for the seller to fix those items before it closes okay and so talking about fixing items yeah what if you buy a house there needs to be a lot of repair yeah. on it mm -hmm. can you take out a loan, loan to repair the house yes Absolutely. There's what you call an FHA 203K rehabilitation loan. Um, it's not the most popular loan program, but it's definitely out there and it has helped a lot of our families buy a property that maybe needs some fixes and you can do it in collaboration with FHA loan. I would just recommend they call into our office so we can go over the details on that. Okay. Now, yes. uh, everybody who isn't a homeowner currently renting right currently yes. renting marami tayong mga kababayan na nagre-rent yes ano bang mas uh, what is a better thing to, to do? do 
Yes, is it, it to is rent? harder to buy or to rent? Mm -hmm. So let's look at some stats. And the a Federal Reserve Board gives us some really, really uh, solid stats. And just statistically, the net worth of a homeowner is significantly higher than that of a renter. Okay. For example, if you make 80,000 annual income, mm -hmm. the net worth of a homeowner is about 450,000, according to the Federal Reserve Board, versus about 90,000 for a renter see how big that difference is right or if they if you make 50,000 to 80,000 annually a year um, the net worth changes from about 125,000 roughly to for a homeowner to about 25,000 for a renter so you can see the spread is so significant yeah so, so so if you want a net worth that's higher obviously bumili na kayo ng bahay yes. if you think na hindi nyo kaya get in touch with McLeod yes. & Associates because they can help you figure out all the different options, options the and financing. loans. Yes. They know all the, the loans that are out there that you may not know about. Yes, there's even 0% down programs right now mm -hmm. where you can get grants. People think they have to put a big down payment. You do not need to. So again, we do free buyer-seller consults. I recommend they just give us a call. Yes. And again, home ownership, uh, the net worth, you could pass it down. It's a legacy. You could pass that property down generations. Yes, and I house. know that there is a new property that is available at the yes. Jerupa Valley. Yes. Oh, this hit the market. And you know, the seller wasn't intending to sell this. This is a fantastic deal. This was a new build. Just got built six to seven months ago. Again, seller had no intention of selling, but there's some things in their life that is causing them to sell. They, she put in upgrades, flooring, bathroom, kitchen, um, upgraded uh, the backyard, and this is being offered for $399,000. It's a four bedroom with a loft three baths, over 2,500 square feet, close to a cute little park. This is in Harupa Valley in Riverside County. Okay, so. ako naman, Jarupa. <laughs> Harupa yeah. pala siya. Yeah. Sorry, <laughs> hindi ko alam kung saan No, yun. you can pronounce it either okay, way. Okay, so yes. Riverside. Riverside County. Really, this is going to be a phenomenal deal for any first-time homebuyer family or even an investor because the new builds that are coming out are already selling higher right. than what this is being offered at. Okay, so make sure to contact McLeod & Associates if you're interested in this property. Also, you can get a free online home evaluation. Make sure to go to their website at mcleod.smarthomeprice.com. Dot com. Yes, you can just enter your address in there over lunch or after hours or at work and you'll get a free market analysis report for, to see how much your value is, how yes. much your house is worth, right? Okay, and also McLeod & Associates um, does take referrals, so make yeah. sure kung meron po kayong kilala na mag, mag, uh, bebenta ng bahay nila or is looking to buy a home, mm -hmm. get in touch with them because they have a great referral program. We do, absolutely. We welcome referrals and we we definitely appreciate it. All right, maraming salamat Mia and uh, I'm so thankful that you come here to Kababayan today okay. to really give all this information to all of us that are hoping one day yes. <laughs> they no, will buy a house. Absolutely, <laughs> everyone has a house waiting for them so just give us a call. All right, maraming yeah. salamat. Free po yung consultation nila, mm -hmm. uh, McLeod and Associates, yan po yung telepono na pwede yung tawagan at marami pong salamat for watching our show today. Paalam na po. Bye.